According to legend, Mount Pelio was once home to the centaurs. Now it's a picturesque tourist spot and the perfect place to get married. For the happy couple and guests, this wedding is a time for celebration. For the hard-working restaurateur providing lunch, it's a lifeline. The side effects of crisis is that we have increased taxes, uh, people don't go out that much, and we, we just survived here. So you're pretty lucky with the wedding? Yes. Nikolas Theakos has been working here since he was 15, the third generation in his family to run the Hortansia Taverna. Once it was always crowded, but since Greece fell on hard times, he's been living off Sunday lunches. Is it possible that the restaurant might not survive? Yes, there's always a possibility. This is open for, as a business, it's open for 70 years or more for my great-grandfather. If I close it, to me it means that I did something wrong in all these years I am here. <laughs> Nicolas knows that in these uncertain times, he needs to prepare for the worst. In the city of Volos, not far from his village, Nicolas has enrolled in a vocational college. Nicola, are you here? Better have a diploma so I can, you know, might leave Greece and go somewhere to work. Just in case. Just in case. Just to make sure that I have a future. Does the crisis also make it difficult to pay to study at a place like this? Well, the crisis made it hard to pay. Sometimes because our customers keep reducing, there are months that we struggle even to pay our fees here in, in the school. Luckily for Nicolas, he doesn't have to pay all his fees in euros. That's because in Volos, there's more than one kind of money. Nicolas can pay 30% of his tuition fees using TEM, a currency found only here in Volos. The local network for exchange and solidarity, which runs this new financial system, is based in the shop of seamstress Angeliki Ioanniti. Having an alternative currency isn't unique. There are similar networks in other parts of the world and more than a dozen here in Greece. But with 900 members and more joining every day, this is the largest in a country unsure of what money it will be using in a few months' time. Katya Laraseo's cafe provides a good example of how the system works. Yes, Katya. As a TEM member, Katya allows other members to pay part of their bills using TEM, which have the same value as euros. In an indirect form of barter, her customers earn TEM by also providing goods or services to the network. With customers who are short of euros, and a cafe where business has plunged 40% in the last year, there's a clear benefit to all. Λοιπόν, 3.80 από το τσάι είναι 2.30 σε ευρώ και ένα πενήτα σε τεμ. Tem doesn't exist as notes or coins. Katya just records the transaction and the virtual money will be transferred online. She needs at least a portion of the cost in euros in order to pay her expenses. 
παλιά, ξέρεις, γινόταν ανταλλαγέ στα χωριά. Ο ένας έδινε καρύδια, ο άλλος έδινε τις πατάτες. Δηλαδή ήταν από παλιά αυτό το σύστημα, αλλά ήταν με άλλο τρόπο. Όσο, όσο περισσότερες υπηρεσίες μπαίνουν, είναι τόσο καλύτερο. Γιατί βάζουμε σε κίνηση όλη την κοινωνία. Κατάλαβα. Λοιπόν, σας ευχαριστώ πάρα πολύ. Έγινε, να είσαι καλά. Αντίο σας. Γεια σας, γεια σας. Καλώς ήρθες, Καλώς ήρθες, Καλώς ήρθες, καλά. Angeliki's sewing business is down 60% since the crisis hit. Well, I got a tire puncher yesterday, so I need to fix my attire today. I'm going through the system. Members of the network advertise their products and services online. So I'm looking for tire repair services. Okay, here I am. Yanis Grigoriou was one of the founders of TEM. He manages social programs for the Volos City Council. It's a social laboratory, I, I always like to call it, because that change is happening all the time, and obviously, as the crisis is deepening here in our country, now we have uh, more chances <laughs> and maybe more opportunities to explore this ground because all the, everything is new. <laughs> Unemployment in Volos is now running at 20%. Those lucky enough to have a job have seen their salaries slashed. Yanis has taken a 25% pay cut which means servicing his car is not a priority. People often join Tim to make money. They soon discover that solidarity, not profit, is the invisible hand in this market. At first, it's uh, only for advertising. A way of letting people know. Yes. Yeah. Uh, after a few months, uh, I want to help people. Because you get more customers? No, 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 because I see that there are other people who are working. There are other people who are working to get out of their job. Το αυτοκίνητο του είναι ανάγκη. Πρέπει να πάνε να ψάξουν δουλειά. Χρήματα δεν έχουν, οπότε υπάρχει το τέμ. Θα σε πληρώσω με την επιταγή. Το ίδιο πράγμα είναι. There are safeguards to prevent the profit motive from taking hold and to keep the money in circulation. For example, no one is allowed to accumulate more than 1200 τέμ. Ορίστε. Ευχαριστώ πολύ. Τέλεια. It's good as money. Yes, because uh, with this stem, I'm going to buy marmalade for my kids, honey, oil of oil. Of oil. I can uh, fix something electric uh, in, uh, in my store. It's like uh, Euro. The TEM economy, unlike the national one, is always growing. The Volos City Council has recently agreed to accept a portion of some fees in TEM, and the network has started a weekly market for members. It's good? Very good. <laughs> what is it? Uh, uh, chocolate cake. Yes, eight TEM only. For every purchase, the buyer and seller's details are written on a slip of paper and the TEM transferred online. But is it better for you to spend TEM or Euros? Uh, TEM, of course. Why? <laughs> I don't have Euro! <laughs> with my Euro, I pay my bills. And uh, with TEM, I pay my food. Euro, we have a lot of food. We have a lot of food. 
Εδώ είναι διάφορα είδη το οποίο έχει ένα κατάστημα και τα φέρνει για να τα δώσει. Είναι όλα καινούργια όπω βλέπετε. Αλλά ταυτόχρονα η κυρία, καθότι είναι νοικοκυρά και έξυπνη, έφτιαξε και αυτά τα είδη. Τα οποία και αυτά προσφέρονται με τέμπου. Και έτσι είναι ένα επιπλέον βοήθεια. The stall is filled with stock from a business that went bust a year ago. Και ζούμε ότι πάραμε από εδώ. Παράδειγμα σήμερα τι πήρα εγώ από εδώ. Πήρα αυγά, πήρα μαρούλια, πήρα ένα τενεκέ λάδι. Ότι για ήδη διατροφή στο σπίτι, που αυτά δεν μπορώ πλέον να τα πάρω. Δίνω και γίνεται ανταλλαγή. Λάδι είναι αυτό. It's kind of strange to see all this stuff on sale and realize you don't need any actual money. <laughs> it's good, isn't it? It's like a mix of the world's economy. It's like when there's a crisis, it's like when there's a crisis. I buy marmalade, with, uh, strawberry marmalade. Yes, yes. Today I'm rich. I have 10. Okay? I don't have euro. I have 10. I am rich. How do you start a currency from scratch? How do you create money from nothing? Because we believe that the creation of, of value, which means currency, as in your question, is the right of any individual and the right of a community. This is still capitalism, but with a kind of face. <laughs> Ένα πράγμα θα πω ότι μία μέρα εδώ είναι μια εβδομάδα δουλειά έξω. Αν αυτό λέει κάτι, εδώ ο κόσμο αγοράζει πολύ πιο εύκολα και υπάρχει αλληλεγγύη με συνεννόηση χωρί να σε προδιαθέτει με αρνητική ενέργεια. Αγοράζει κάτι και το εκτιμάει την αγορά που κάνει. Εκτιμά ενώ έξω σε πιέζουν λε και δεν έχει καμιά αξία. Λε και το ευρώ έχει αξία ενώ το είδο αυτό δεν έχει καμιά αξία. Ενώ εδώ έχει αξία και το αλεύρι και τα αυγά, οτιδήποτε. The mainstream economy thinks that these people have no value at all. They are not useful. So we, we think the opposite. Everybody has something to offer. Θες να πληρώσεις, θες να γίνεις πάλι, να αισθανθείς πάλι άνθρωπος. Και να πληρώσεις με οτιδήποτε, είτε με τέμ, είτε με λάδι, με πατάτες. Είτε με αρκεί να έχει κάτι να πληρώσει να αγοράσει. Είναι ένα liberating feeling. We have to, 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 to see ourselves able to do this. This is something once we realize the potential of this, maybe the whole world will change. Πέρα του ότι εμεί θα γαμογελάμε πάντα.